what's going on, everybody? Dogman Dan here. We're in Euro Truck Simulator 2. We're going to look at the Freightliner Argosy CAT or CAT model version, if you will. Uh, of course, download in the description for all the stuff that I am running. Uh, in version 118.3s is what I think what I'm at right now, uh, but it's it's 118 Steam version release. Okay. Um, I had this one a while ago, but it, it had some problems with it. And so now it's been updated. It's got some nice options that are available for us. Some new fenders, some sky skirts, uh, decent engines, um, some new accessories. Lighting is pretty decent. There's a lot of things that you could do uh, in here. Everything seems to work pretty well. I spent a lot of time within the actual um, customization shop. There's also uh, one paint scheme on it that you can set up your own colors, which I, I have. You see the... The Nog Army colors there, the black, blue, and the yellow, uh, which is pretty awesome. And uh, overall, the truck is pretty nice, I would say. Inside the car, the, the cabin is pretty nice. You can't actually go into the bed or the cabin, you know, the back behind the seats type of thing, which I always love when you can do that with, with the mods and you can actually go to the back of the truck, which is awesome. But uh, overall, it's nicely done. There's a couple options in there as well. Uh, seems to drive nice. I only tried the 750 horsepower uh caterpillar engine there is a thousand twenty horsepower engine or something like that uh but uh i i didn't really have a need to use it um it drives pretty good it seems pretty powerful for some reason though it does get a little sluggish the moment you attach a trailer it seems to just get really sluggish uh but overall pretty decent and and fun to drive i do like it so i will probably keep it on there uh, for driving purposes, just to have some fun with it. Found over in the Volvo dealer. Um, no problems as far as anything else concerned. I didn't have any kind of uh, any kind of cr game crashes or anything like that at all. So definitely have some fun with it. Uh, if it's if it's if you're into Freightliners, it's pretty cool. It's a nice mod. Uh, overall, I do recommend it. Um, and uh, yeah, so if you have comments or questions, I just wanted to keep it pretty quick and simple here. Uh, always feel free to leave them below. Otherwise, again, the links in the description for all the ETS2 mods that I'm running. Not everything runs at the same time, and always make sure you back up your profile before you add a new mod on, just as FYI. Um, otherwise, I will catch you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching, as always. We'll see you soon.